But right now at 6, CBS News Miami sits down with Miami mayor and presidential candidate Francis Suarez. Mayor Suarez talking to our Peter Dench about his presidential bid. And as Peter reports, Suarez spoke on camera for the first time about the consulting fee controversy swirling around him. Francis Suarez is now addressing the controversy about the consulting fees he received from a developer, $10,000 a month, to help with permits for a real estate venture. Yes, of course, I have outside income. Uh, of course, uh, outside income is allowed, and of course, the city attorney has said outside income is allowed. Uh, 31 out of 34 mayors in Dade County have outside income. So it's very typical, and I've had it in my entirety of my 13-year career, without any ethical issues, without any ethical blemishes. The Miami-Dade Ethics Commission is looking into it. I have never used my public position to benefit a private party. I'm never going to do that. Um, and I'm always going to focus on uh, defending uh, the interests of my people. I asked Suarez why he is running for president. I'm running for president, Peter, because I think I have something different to offer this country. I think I look different, I sound different, and I have a different message. Uh, it's a positive, inspirational, and aspirational message that focuses on what I'm for, not necessarily on what I'm against, and that's focused on tackling the big problems of this country. Suarez says the federal deficit is a top priority. I think in the deficit, for example, I'm the only candidate that's actually cut a budget by 20 percent, which is exactly how much we have to cut from the federal budget. And I've said that the courage it takes to make those tough choices doesn't depend on the number of zeros. The 45-year-old Suarez is the only Latino GOP candidate for president. He says being Hispanic will help him solve immigration issues. In terms of immigration, I mean, we've got to get past this logjam on immigration. And I think having a Hispanic Republican president uh, gives uh, the country a tremendous amount of credibility on who the messenger is to solve that problem. Suarez says he will point to what he's done as mayor. Our formula for success here in Miami is one that really can be scaled nationally. One is we've kept taxes low, which has created double-digit growth. We increased funding for our police while other cities defunded their police. And we have the lowest per capita homicide rate since 1964. Suarez says a key goal right now is qualifying for the first Republican debate on August 23rd. He'll need at least 40,000 donors to qualify for that. So there is a lot of work to be done. In Miami, Peter Danch, CBS News, Miami.